breaking news. It's back to the drawing board on the death penalty deliberations for Seifulo Saipov. A judge just decided an alternate juror will be recalled. Now, deliberations must restart from the beginning. Eyewitness News reporter NJ Burkett live outside the courthouse in Lower Manhattan. NJ. Yeah, that's right, Dave. The sensitive deliberations here hit a roadblock this morning when one of the jurors called the judge's chambers and said he could no longer continue. That juror is now being replaced with an alternate, and yes, the judge is instructing the jury that they must begin their deliberations all over again. What it likely means for Saifulo Saipov is that he will need to wait that much longer, Dave, to learn his fate. Saipov was convicted, as you know, last month for the horrific attack on the Hudson River bike path that left eight people dead and 18 injured, many of them seriously. Prosecutors have described him as a proud terrorist who carried out the attack in the name of ISIS. Jurors are weighing whether Saipov should be put to death or whether he should receive life in prison without the possibility of parole. Now, this morning, juror number four called the court, distraught apparently, to say that his brother had suffered a heart attack, that he was at the ICU, and that he could no longer continue. The defense moved for a mistrial. That was denied. And they are now in the process of replacing the juror with an alternate. Now, the alternates have been showing up every day here at the courthouse, but they have not been party to the deliberations. So for that reason, the judge is instructing the jurors that they must begin their deliberations anew, essentially telling them to go back to the drawing board, that they have to start this process all over again. Now, fortunately, deliberations went on for barely three hours yesterday, so they're not that far into it. But is it a setback? No question about it. Live